uh, and others are placing on the business in terms of new ways to interact uh, with them. And like all business, uh, business issues, it really requires a complete business transformation. And like all transformations, it involves people, process, and technology. And that's the way we've structured our day today, is to give you some insight into the, the people, the process, and the technology aspects of the transformation that's required for you uh, to achieve continuous delivery. Continuous delivery is not something in a box you buy or a piece of software you buy. It is far from that. It is a complete transformation that does require all three aspects. And uh, that's what we're going to be talking about today. So let's talk about uh, who we have uh, to speak with you today. We have uh, from uh, Forrester Research, Principal Analyst Kurt Bittner is here with us today. Kurt covers uh, continuous delivery as well as other application development and agile um, topics for uh, Forrester Research. Also speaking is Sasha Labore, the CEO of Cloudbees, along with Chris Mills, the Chief Technology Officer of EMEA uh, for Pivotal Labs. Also, Andrew Phillips, the Vice President of Products at Zebia Labs, will be speaking. David Doty, Release Engineer with Barclays. Kosuke Kawaguchi, the creator of Jenkins and the CloudBees Chief Technology Officer. Gareth Lynn, Performance Engineering for EMEA for SOSTA. David Sayers, Director and Co-Founder for Midvision. Federico Voyez, uh, Professional Services Engineer with Puppet Labs. And Mark Rendell, Senior Manager at Accenture. So as you can see, we've got uh, some great speakers uh, to talk to you today, and it'll be a very, uh, I think, a very enlightening day. Let's go through the agenda. As I mentioned, the morning sessions are a little, going to be a little more executive oriented. So we start off uh, the day with uh, Kurt Bittner from Forrester talking to us about the business of continuous delivery. At 9.45, Sasha Labore and Chris Mills will come up and talk about orchestrating the continuous delivery process. Then we'll take a break at 10.30. That will be in the next room. Uh, and then at 11, uh, we have the three pillars of continuous delivery, culture, tooling, and practices by Andrew Phillips of Zebia Labs. At 11.45, continuous delivery in the real world with David, Do David Doty, sorry about that mistake there, uh, from Barclays. And at lunch, uh, we have uh, our birds of a feather sessions uh, at the round tables in the lunch area. So at lunchtime, as I mentioned, uh, we'll be in the, you'll be able to sit down in the James Watt room. And uh, we have uh, several round tables set up there. And you'll be able to sit at any of these tables and have a discussion around each of these topics. So find one of these topics that's of interest to you. And then you can see who they are facilitated, facilitated by. Uh, Kurt Bittner from Forrester will be facilitating developing a continuous delivery strategy. CloudBees will be facilitating two tables, uh, a Jenkins table and an advanced Jenkins table. Uh, Midvision automated deployment. Zebia Labs planning for continuous delivery. Zebia Labs will also be discussing business issues with continuous delivery. SOSTA will be talking about testing. And Pivotal will be talking about continuous delivery and platform as a service. So a lot of great, great topics there. For the afternoon, uh, the afternoon will kick off uh, with a talk by Kosuke Kawaguchi uh, on continuous delivery powered by <coughs> Jenkins. At 2.30, accelerating application delivery with continuous testing by Gareth Lynn of SOSTA. Uh, at 3 o'clock, deployment automation by David Sayers at Midvision. Then we'll take a break at 3.30. At 4 o'clock, we have automating infrastructure by Federico Voyez of Puppet Labs. And at 4.30, Overcoming Impedance to Continuous Delivery by Mark Rendell of Accenture. And then at 5 o'clock, uh, we'll have our Ask the Experts uh, session along with our reception. It'll be interesting to see how those two things come together, a little bit of beer and wine and, and discussion. That's going to take place actually in that James Watt room. We actually need to um, leave these, these rooms, these two rooms, at 5 o'clock. So I just want to make everybody aware of that. They have another event coming in this evening, so we've got to vacate these rooms, and we'll be in the James Watt room for our reception. Any questions? Okay, with that, I'd like to introduce you to Kurt Bittner. Kurt is a leading expert on agile and iterative software development approaches, including application lifecycle management. He focuses on the organizational and cultural shifts necessary to extract broader business value from software development processes. 
He's based in Boulder, Colorado in the U.S. Kurt? 